TIF, transoral incisionless fund application, is an incisionless surgical procedure that reconstructs the body's natural physical barrier to reflux. Inserted through the mouth, the esophix device is used to construct a durable anti-reflux valve, re-establishing a natural barrier to reflux. TIF is surgery without incisions or the complications associated with more invasive surgical procedures. TIF is performed under constant visualization by the surgeon. While the patient is under general anesthesia, the esophix device riding over the endoscope is gently glided down through the patient's mouth into the stomach. The stomach is inflated and the endoscope is advanced and turned so that it is looking up at the entrance to the stomach. This is where the anti-reflux valve will be created. The tissue mold is then advanced into the stomach. The tissue retractor is engaged at the Z-line, a line that marks where the esophagus and stomach come together. The tissue is retracted into the tissue mold. Some patients may have a small hiatal hernia, a condition where a portion of the stomach has migrated up through the diaphragm into the chest cavity. If present, hiatal hernia can be reduced and the esophagus can be lengthened by retracting the endoscope up into the esophagus. Suction is then engaged and the stomach is then repositioned down below the diaphragm. The esophagus device is then rotated, wrapping the fundus toward the lesser curvature of the stomach. Under visual control, the esophagus device is then used to deploy two H-shaped fasteners to hold the fold of tissue in place and maintain the wrap. The wrap is then tightened further and the next pair of fasteners are placed one centimeter above the Z-line. This procedure is repeated on the opposing side. The valve is extended, creating a long three to five centimeter flap and securing it with H-shaped fasteners. TIF is long lasting. Studies show that in the weeks following TIF, a natural healing process called serosal fusion occurs, creating a layer of fibrous and fibroelastic tissue to bond and secure the tissue folds. Durability of the valve and clinical efficacy have been confirmed in long-term studies. Clinical results have been excellent, comparable to more invasive procedures, but without incisions or the long-term complications associated with laparoscopic procedures for reflux.